to my channels and within me okay today's quickie reading is for Scorpio Sun Moon Rising and this is to see what is going on with your love life at this time okay what does Scorpio need to know at this time regarding their love life what love messages do we have for Scorpio at this time what does Scorpio need to know regarding their love life ooh, ooh, ooh. what do we have here okay okay Scorpio you get this last time go and check my my last reading for you um you get here king of cups pisces cancer scorpio or somebody that is um emotional um sensitive a little bit dramatic loving nonetheless and uh two of pentacles here so if this is not your energy this could be you dealing with somebody else uh and two of pentacles so i see juggling here juggling juggling what what do you got going on let me grab my other deck let me yeah, let me grab this one. All right, what's what's going on here with uh, Scorpio? What is Scorpio juggling here in love? You got this person. What's going on? Or what are you juggling? Juggling emotions, decision. What what is Scorpio juggling at this time? Please clarify the two of Pentacles for Scorpio here. Why is the two of pentacles here? Please clarify the two of pentacles. Okay, let's see. Okay, you got a few cards here. All right, so here we have king of cups like i said so this is you or the person you're dealing with and what's going on here juggling what are we juggling so we're clarifying the juggling what are you trying to figure out here scorpio all right so we have here strength also leo energy okay so you're trying to make a decision here and you're you're trying to be very very strong okay then we have here all right for some of you you have multiple people okay we have the emperor so with the emperor here, um, you're trying to get your power back or you're feeling like you're within your power. You're, you're, you might also be dealing with somebody that's an authority figure or in control. Um, I'm also getting financial stability because we have here the king of coins, which is the king of pentacles. King of pentacles is um, earth sign, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. So you might be dealing with that also. And this is somebody that is like financially stable and, financially stable and grounded. Could even be somebody that is wealthy. So you um, might be dealing with another water sign and an earth sign here. Um, that you're trying to juggle between these two people and you're trying to stay strong because you you want to stay within your your power you you basically have the control here with this emperor energy to pick between these two now this may also mean because this is a general reading this king of coins this king of pentacles may be the emperor this person might be the wealthy person in power in control here um and if this is your energy you're trying to stay strong because you might be in a relationship where this person is just too controlling overbearing and at the same time they're the ones that are, are making the bulk of the money so you might be feeling kind of stuck in where you are and not you know even though you're staying strong you're not sure what you should do which is why we have the juggling here so you're either juggling between two people or um, you might be dealing with somebody that is um, controlling and, you know, um, makes the bulk of the money. So it's like, okay, how do I get out of this situation? Okay, so if that's the case, let me just pull some cards real quick to see. I'm trying to keep this as a quick reading. What advice? Do you have for Scorpio? What should Scorpio do in regards to this reading? Okay, yeah, stabbed in the back. 
heartbreak, pain, separation, deception, shocking attack. So yeah, so if you are in a, a negative relationship here and you're trying to figure out, you're juggling what you should do because this person broke your heart. They deceived you. That You feel like they stabbed you in the back. You might even, uh, you might be separated or your answer is to get separated. Okay, hang on. Another card fell. Okay, yeah. Um, the runner, runner in a codependent relationship, fear of intimacy, listening to ego. Now, this could be your energy or their energy. Okay, and then we have here, not today, not dealing hurt, avoiding a conversation call or person boundaries, still angry. So there may be a separation here, like I said, and this person is not speaking to you or you're not speaking to this person. Maybe um, you left and now you're trying to figure out what you should do because this person stabbed you in the back. Um, yeah, it could be you left. We have the runner here. You're trying to get your power back and you left because you don't like what this person did and they might be calling you, you know, trying to be all loving now and you're like, mm, no, I, I got to stay strong. You know, I have to get my power back and I got to figure out what to do here. So you're on the right path if this is what you're doing. Okay. All right. Let's see. Stand your ground is the message for you here. Stand your ground. Let me actually... Scorpio, you need more, more advice and guidance. What advice and guidance do we have for Scorpio? And that's just regarding this part of the reading. All right. For those of you that this resonates with, what's, what advice do you have for Scorpio? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Ready, set, go. Now is the perfect moment to dive in and embrace your heart's desire. So if you really want to leave, now is the time to do it. You know? Time to move on. It's time to let go of the old and worn out so that the new can come in. So you're looking for answers. This is it. It's, it's straight forward here. Okay. So that's that's your guidance and advice. Now let's go to my initials, traits, and features and see who is Scorpio dealing with. Who is Scorpio dealing with? All right. We have the letter Y. Um, you might also want to know why. Why this person did this. Why this person did that. E, I'm saying like Y E S. If you had a yes or no question, yes is here. It can also be someone's initials. Y E. We have H. Hey is spelled out H E Y. Somebody might be like hey. So if, if somebody that you're with, they go hey, or hey hey hey. You know, just hey. Okay, that's coming through. Q. Somebody with the initial Q, or they live in Queens or Quebec or anything with the letter Q. Um, However, Q is relevant to you to describe this person if it's not their initials. Okay, now let's go and see what are their traits and features. What are Scorpio's person's traits and features? All right, thank you. All right, so they have piercings. They're independent. Let me get my finger off that and spiritual or spiritual this is a general reading so they don't have to be all of these things okay okay let's pull a little bit more for you here okay what else does scorpio need to know regarding this love reading last shuffle Venus, the part of you that desires beauty, success, indulgence, and valuables. So like I said, this person might be a little super, superficial. Um, or for those of you that are juggling between two people, you may want to choose the person that is wealthier because they have more power. And, and there's a part of you that desires beauty, success, and you want to you know, indulge in the finer things in life. And there's nothing wrong with that. So that could be for those of you that are like, oh, who do I decide between, you know, the person that's going to give you what you want, that's going to make you happy with what you're yearning for. Okay. All right. So those are your messages. Scorpio, thank you so much for liking, sharing, watching, and subscribing. Please um, click the bell and select all so you'll be notified every time I post new content. Um, 
I try to post as often as I can. I'm also a realtor. If you're interested in real estate, check out my other YouTube channel, Zen Within Me Homes. Um, I'm a spiritual as well, and I love to do my readings and give you guys um, free advice and assistance spiritually. Um, so I try to post as often as I can. I do definitely post monthly readings. I try to do more beyond that. So I have spiritual products as well, perfumes, um, bath salts, my Oracle deck, my timing stones. Everything is there at zenwithinme.com. Links down below in the description box. Peace and love. Stay safe, and I will see you in the next reading.